Our top story this evening, the Jack Cafferty Arts and Cultural Center in Welch hosted an event to demonstrate the bola wrap to departments from surrounding areas. Newswatch reporter Jake Karalexis explains the importance of this event and the impact bola wrap will have on law enforcement going forward. The bola wrap is a new technology designed for compromised people who may be mentally challenged. It's currently being used by over 200 agencies in 44 states, and today was the first time Bowler Wrap was exposed to West Virginia. The Bowler Wrap is unique in that it's like a flying set of handcuffs. It provides standoff distance for the officer to engage that tactical time, wrap the person, and then safely handcuff them. All right, so this is the first demonstration of the bowler wrap in the state of West Virginia. Now, two officers have already gone before me, which makes me patient too. Mr. Sherrod from Bola Technologies is going to be deploying the bowler wrap. Remember, there's two target zones, but for the purpose of this, we're just going to be aiming right down here. And the purpose of the bowler wrap is to increase safety while decreasing force. Here we go. Alright, so there we go. No pain, minimal use of force. That's the bowler app. Another benefit to incorporating bowler app into police and sheriff's departments is that it will give communities insight into what tools their departments are using. The community should be in favor of, of giving any valuable tool to their officers to handle situations that they encounter on the street. Because it can vary from time to time what they're, what they're going to be, be dealt with. The bola wrap will make its way into West Virginia shortly and will provide departments with an appropriate measure to gain compliance from those who are putting themselves or others in danger. In McDowell County, Jake Karalexis, Newswatch. The bola wrap has been well received among the agencies where it is currently in use.